<laughs> awkward, yeah, recording. <laughs> Don't talk. You look weird. <laughs> you remind me of Zaro. <laughs> Go up with it. Go up. Even though I was given the heads up of how this mask is, I didn't expect it to be so extremely cold. But once completely fitted on my face, it felt so good, so gratifying. Sitting in the waiting area, analyzing my face because it looks good and it feels so smooth after a microdermabrasion treatment and just enjoying some me time because I often neglect my face because I know I have good skin and is not normally troubled with much facial or skin issues. But I am now 41 and is now more cautious as I get older. But even as I age, I still need to take care of myself. Taking a second look a third look, a fourth look, and even a fifth look at how wonderful, at how the expert did a wonderful job. All right? I love when persons are professional and they know what they're doing. So I'm utilizing this space before I go back to recording my daughter's experience. And I'm enjoying every moment of the day. It was well spent. I just had my second facial and it was awesome. All right, awesome. Better than the first to be exact. Alright? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't see how this beautiful face is glowing. Oh my god, it's glowing. Yeah. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Love it. Alright? And my daughter is doing hers now all right so after a semester of hard work and dedication i decided that she deserves a facial all right so she's actually doing hers now you'll see
Okay, so you have my cleanser. It is the salicylic acid cleanser, and it's supposed to, you know, clear up your pores so that you can moisturize your face. So what I'm doing is just, you know, try. So next, we're going to apply vitamin C, E, and D moisturizer. Both it and the salicylic acid cleanser are supposed to be used twice daily. And so, I'm just going to apply a little bit. I'm going to take 
Just a bit more. Just this. Try it. I look for it. Grab a needle so that there is no white cast. As you can see, it's going to take a little bit of it. Yeah. Okay. Tingles a bit. And this is my new nightly, not just nightly, but daily routine for my acne. Welcome to my morning and night facial routine. V Renewing SA Cleanser is suitable for normal skin types, especially rough and bump skin. And as for me, my skin has fine bumps more than they have rough bumps. So this is even more so suitable for my normal skin type. It contains ceramides, which are naturally found in your skin and play a vital role in helping your skin protect you. They help fill in the gaps between your cells so your skin can seal in moisture and seal out impurities. Another ingredient is hyaluronic acid, which helps retain the skin's natural moisture. And for me, there are aspects of my face that lack moisture. Another ingredient is niacinamide, which helps calm the skin. It also contains salicylic acid, which helps to slow off excess oil, sebum, and dead skin cells from the skin surface, revealing softer and smoother and brighter skin. So this product will be used daily. Another plus to using CeraVe Renewing SA Cleanser is that it is fragrance free and it is also allergy tested. So if you're of the normal type skin, 
then this is most definitely for you. So the second product is Black Girl Sunscreen, which is created for everyday use to prevent sun damage. And especially if you are an individual who moves about in the sun as often as some of us do, then this is perfect for you. All right? And it is filled with key ingredients that will protect your skin from the sun and doubles as a moisturizing lotion. So for some of us who find it difficult to purchase and use a moisturizer and a sunscreen separately, then this is just right for you because it's all combined in one moisturizer and a sunscreen so it's perfect black girl sunscreen dries completely clear so it's perfect to use before any outdoor activity and it leaves no white residue and it is also fragrance free and it is also water resistant for at least 80 minutes. All right, so it is easy also to apply on the skin. It does not um, cause any irritation or burning while you are in the process of doing so. And it depends on how much you use at any given time it may take a longer while to actually um dissolve or rubs out right so some persons may use more while some may use less depending on whichever reason or situation so yeah The use of sunscreen reduces your chance of developing skin cancer and it is recommended to limit your time in the sun between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. So wear long clothing, sunglasses, hats where necessary to keep yourself protected. Please subscribe to the channel. Thank you.